Hello and welcome back to another video. This problem, we're told that Ken is working this summer as part of a crew on a farm. He earns $8 an hour for the first 10 hours he worked, and then he gets a pay bump, and after that he gets $10 per hour. Now we're asked, if he saves 90% of his earnings, what is the least number of hours he must work to save at least $270 for the week? So if he's saving 90% of his earnings, then 90% of the total has to be equal to 270, right? This is the minimum, right? If we are looking for all possible values that he could work to save at least 270, we would say it's greater than or equal to, right? Because if he worked like an infinite number of hours, that'd be an infinite amount of money, which is greater. But we're just looking for the very minimum. So 90% of this minimum total is equal to exactly $270 because we have to save at least exactly 270 is going to be the minimum. What is 90%? Well, a percent is just a number out of 100. So 90 over 100 times the total is equal to 270. 90 over 100 is the same as 9 over 10 times the total is equal to 270. And then if we want to multiply both sides by 10, then these disappear, and then we multiply it over here. So 10 times 270 is 2,700, right? Just adding a zero when you're multiplying by 10 is equal to nine times the total amount of money he's gonna make this week. Um, the reason I'm doing this and not plugging it into my calculator right away is because this is on the no calculator section, so we have to do it the long way. And when I divide both sides by nine, we have the total is equal to 2,700 divided by nine 2700 is 27 times 100 divided by 9. So we have 27 over 9 times 100 is a way you can rearrange this, right? 27 over 9 is 3. 3 times 100 is 300. So he has to work for enough time to get $300 if he wants to save 270. So $300 is going to be the total, which means it's the amount he made in the first 10 plus everything else. Well, how much did he make in the first 10? Well, he made $8 an hour for 10 hours. So he made eight times 10, $80. Plus let's call the number of hours he worked after the first 10 uh, X. So X times, and then he gets $10 per hour, is going to be the amount of money he makes for the rest of the week. So we have 300 is equal to eight times 10 is equal to $80. Again, $8 for 10 hours is $80. Plus $10 for X hours is 10X, 10 times X. Now we can solve for X. Subtract 80 from both sides, these cancel, and you get 300 minus 80 is 220 is equal to 10x. Divide both sides by 10. You get x is equal to 22, sorry, 220 over 10, which is 22. So this is the amount of hours he has to work after the first 10 to save at least $270. 22 is going to be your final answer in C. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and we'll see you in the next video.